Hey everybody, Frugal Farmer here. This is my jalapeno meatloaf. And what you do, you can either use fresh or pickled jalapenos. I've got a jar of diced that I've used. And I put three good helping spoonfuls in there. I'm probably going to regret that tomorrow, but for tonight I'm going to enjoy it. Anyway, I can put the toilet paper in the freezer. I'm going to put a little bit of Worcestershire, a little bit of brown mustard, some onion powder, some Lowry seasoning, some black pepper, and garlic. Oh, and I'm going to cut up an onion to go in there too. And I've got three biscuits I had left over from when I made some bacon biscuits. And I'm going to put that bread in there to kind of help hold it together. And I'll bake it until it's done. And I'm out of ketchup, and I'm not going to town to get no ketchup with everything going on, so I've got plenty of different type sauces. I've got uh, buffalo wing sauce, all kind of barbecue sauce, and that'll fit just well on this, and a can of corn to accompany it. That'll be some good eating tonight. And basically it's stuff you can have already, you know, if you've got some peppers. And if you don't like the... Uh, jalapenos if that's too spicy for you you can use some bell pepper and uh, put in there and I'll use about one onion in here and because you know how I love my onions and uh, so that'll help set it off but you talk about something good this thing will rock and uh, thanks for stopping by come back again when you will share comment like if you make a meatloaf, tell me about it down there in the comment section or what you would like to see added to it or taken out of it. Thanks for stopping by. God bless.